Evening guys and girls, it's time for our capsule sermon. It's uh, Sunday evening here, and tonight we're going to be in the book of Hebrews again. We're going to be in chapter 4, and I want to read to you verses 15 and 16 when we get ready to read. So I'm going to give you some time to find that in your Bible. Hebrews, if you're not familiar, is in the New Testament, which is in the back half of your Bible. Um, So what I want to talk to you about today is, as believers in Christ, we all know that we're sinners. We've accepted that fact, but we still, uh, we know that Christ has died, died for our sins, that his bloodshed covered our sins, and that we're forgiven of our sins, and that we're going to get to spend eternity in, in heaven with Christ. But we also should recognize that no matter how hard we try, no matter how much good we try to do, we are still going to be sinners. But God knows that too, okay? And, and that's what these verses are talking about. So verse, first I want to read verse 15. It says, For we do not have a high priest who cannot sympathize with our weaknesses, but was in all points tempted as we are, yet without sin. So what that reminds us is that Christ himself lived a life as a man on earth and he was tempted and faced with all the same things that we go through, yet he didn't sin. So he can sympathize with us because he knows what we've gone through. But this is what, what often gets left out of this, ver or the, this, this part of scripture here that I think is so important. I want you all to get from it. So verse 16 says, Let us therefore come boldly to the throne of of grace that we may obtain mercy and find grace to help in time of need. So the key word there is to come boldly, meaning that guys, no matter what you go through in your life, no matter how much you think you've, you've done wrong or how much you've sinned and God can't love you, the Bible tells us to come boldly to Christ's throne for grace. If you don't know what grace is, I'm going to explain it. It's super simple. Grace is getting something you don't deserve. That's what grace is. Mercy is not getting what you do deserve. So the, the Bible tells us, this scripture tell us, tells us to come boldly to the throne of grace that we may obtain mercy and find grace to help in time of need. So guys, no matter what you're going through, no matter how bad you feel, no matter you, how far you feel separated from Christ, come boldly to the throne. Remember, I love you, God bless you, and y'all keep praying.